Mexican Marigold, agroplants.org, uh, well known as Tactus erecta. This is a the scientific name. Uh, this uh, colorful flowers can be yellow or orange or white, creamy, uh, full bloom, uh, nice fragrance, and of course they are edible. They can use for salad, mostly salads. Uh, also uh, colored, you can use them for color things. Um, they are very very strong plant, uh, annual plant, and mostly used for the ornamental. It's uh, also uh, insect repellent. Uh, can use for mosquito. Not really working, although it's everywhere. It's say how much it's good for. It. It's not really working. Maybe if you do uh, some uh, product from this, maybe. Uh, but it's also uh, repellent for other insects that. Uh, grow under uh, the root so the passion fruit suffer from a lot of problems so I plant it every year next to my uh, passion fruit one plant or something like this in the season just put one seed two seeds it's very easy to grow it from seeds but this is the best way to start uh, this plant have allopathy uh, qualification uh, it's a problem and advantage, of course, if you don't want uh, bad weeds or just uh, plants that you don't want that will grow in a special location and you don't want every day to go and start to collect all the bad plants that you don't want, uh, this can be used. Uh, mostly it's uh, free of pests and disease. Uh, pruning, I uh, highly recommend a dead flower if you don't need the seeds. So I leave one, uh, two flowers in the end of the season and just collect the seeds, it's enough for next season. Uh, it's a fast growing uh, average amount of water to big amount of water, uh, grows the best in full sun, can with uh, half, half shade or something like this. Uh, it's not big plant, it's like less than one feet or two, two feet depends on uh, the cultivar. Uh, very important. Uh, to know that it's bloom uh, very very fast from the spring to the autumn uh, especially in the hot days if it starts to be cold in the autumn it will reduce the amount of flowers uh, I don't know if it said uh, variety as you can see here it's uh, yellow or orange flowers but also white creamy I less like it I prefer the orange and the yellows are more shiny and bring much more interest to the garden a very strong plant, it can survive in a variety of climates and there is no special requirement to grow it, it's uh, highly recommended. That's all from growplants.org, don't forget to subscribe, visit our website and of course like this video if you have any questions, just ask.